Hello guys, it's your host Michelle Kibe. Welcome to our first episode of Betty Vibe Show. So today we're talking about art and design. We have a guest here who will take us through her, uh, her whole journey of art. So yeah, hi Natalia. Hi. How are you? I'm good, how are you? Um, not so good. So we'd love to know and we'd like to know who's, who's Natalia. Um, hi, my name is Natalia. And um, I am a designer, a graphic designer, I'm an artist, I'm a model, <laughs> yeah. Um, so when did you start your art journey? Well, I, I can't really say precisely when I started my art journey. It's just something that just came up. I, I can't even tell when I, I decided that I want to draw, you know, it's just something that came because my dad is also an artist, so with your dog jeans, something like that. Mm. Oh, okay. Yeah. So we learn to come dog. Yeah, we learn to come dog. Cause after we come dog, bang, I can paint. So we come up with what I paint. At the end, I don't even know my name. Like, why would I do we learn to come dog? I don't even know. So well, we keep to learn to come dog. That's all I can say. Oh, yeah. There's something hard that. Most of artists, they can also be songwriters. Someone told also, me that. I don't know whether it's true. They can also be what? Songwriters. Songwriters. I have written some songs. <laughs> many, many songs. Yes. I have written so many songs. I'm going to say if you're a and I'm so sure. Come on, Jamini, I love data song. Well, it's still a journey because when you have so many things to do, you still don't know what to focus on when you're having like a lot, a lot. Well, it's still something I'm planning to do. I go back at least year 2024. So, Mungu, God and ask you. God and ask you. Okay. So, kwa, in your art life, uh, let's let's transfer in art kwanza. Let's transfer in a graphics kwanza. Mm. Okay, Nini na kuinspire every time kuchora. Well, mostly, I just I think I inspire myself a lot because I live so I live so much in my head more than I do in the physical world. Bitu mingi naona. Okay, yeah, we can just say fifty fifty because bitu mingi zanya naona ndo na choranga. Like with easy bitu zote zinzinendele. We can say you become. Can you name the less I am the things that is trending right now? Am the things that have happened? Is on the between Tachora, but in Tachora, you come a picture, but Niki to China tell the story somehow. A photo, a photo yes, can tell a yes, story. Yes, of course. I Aji. a photo, a single photo. Come yeah. a say, semi Nichore, picture I am to upper. It has a story. Yes, yes, yes. It's it can tell a book, a book like a novel, a story. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have I, I have a few samples though. Yeah. We'll. You can still show us one. If a brief story about. I'm going to look at. I can see that. Well, don't make my my drawing book. Well, it's like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what about well this mm -hmm. is about ladies well physically to up you know na unona msichana na mask like mask ya pesa sindio but okay this is a story about how Nairobi is <laughs> yeah show girls yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. so it's about okay easy match they're not just eyes what wengi like when a man tells you you're beautiful Wanna complimenting it too much, yeah. and that's the beauty. Like anyone, when you're nambongo ni rainbow, nanzianga to commercial. Sinde wa. So now ni wale tu wa rainbow. Like ndomana ni metu me izi macho, ndomana ni me define like to kwe kubwa. And then um izi pesa, ame funi kwa na pesa cause was chanelingi wa nanya mazishangwa na do. Honestly, that's true. Mano me yote amatu mtu yote tata. Acha si mano me pia wa baba. Mm. And um, in a drip, Manisha Pesa Zulisha, Ama Pia Mwenyu Taisha. 
Either yeah. hizo dozi kumalize ama pia wewe unazimaliza. You could drip na maanisha pesa huisha. Pesa ni kuisha. Eh, Mimi ningeulizwa. Ningeulizwa ningesema na salive it. Wewe kuna tama ya pesa. Hii ndio inatumika anyway lakini ina ina, ina drip kwa sababu pesa ni kuisha inaisha. Mm-hmm. And apa hivi mm-hmm. yes it's an effect yes but yeah. it ina represent how it sits dark. Yeah, na dark. inaenda ikikuwa bright. Yeah. So inaenda like e darkness ndio inafanda seti inaenda ikiwa bright. Oh. Well, e darkness inaenda ikipanda ku. Na e darkness inatoka kwa pesa. Mm-hmm. Meaning your life it's like your life is being, is being thrown away ama is being consumed by the darkness and the darkness mm-hmm. is in the money. Yeah. Honestly. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Any other story? Any other picture that can that has yeah. a story? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, that one please start with that. Yeah. <laughs> This is just about feminism or feminism mm-hmm. and uh, basically hapa hivi kuna a lady na kuna the world yeah. and hakuna mtu angekuwa hapa hivi kama sio mwanamke like physically ungekuwa hapa hivi wanaume wa true they don't consume mm. and well it's just the woman holding down the the, the world and the world is us the world is me and the world is you mm-hmm. and uh, anything you think about maybe hata ukisema at me nitajiri kan tajengea nani mm-hmm. unasemanga tu mama mm-hmm. hata kama baba yako hai ama yuko unasemanga tu mama mm-hmm. anything i need to call my mom mm-hmm. anything it's just your mom so it's just appreciating the women even the young ones bora tu they are female mm-hmm. and with everything that has happened around watu kudharauliwa the women gender biasness well this is me appreciating women all over because they hold us down especially our moms tukiwa down hata ukue wapi utaenda tu ku call tu mamako even if she can't help you financially she still help you somehow with some few words and you're good so it's just about appreciating the women mm-hmm. yes any other sample Uh, yes this one this one is actually my favorite yeah mm-hmm. so uh this is about life it's mm-hmm. still a sketch though yeah it's about life mm-hmm. and uh i used the the lady seti kwa sababu na na napendelea wasichana sana ndio watu wengi wanasema na napendelea wasichana sana napendelea lakini the fact that msichana anaza endo na bring life mm. si ndio endo yeah, na bring yeah. life for me ana bring life mm-hmm. and um we are going to start with the dress mm-hmm. so this okay first of all you can see it's a lady walking down the aisle yeah, yeah. but hakuna guest mhm na hata hakuna groom and, uh, and um it's just a casket here yeah. and this is the way of life mm-hmm. you're around doing things the gown this dress she's wearing ni life yake like in the life yake unaweza choose path yako mm-hmm. either unataka kuwa mzuri ama unataka kuwa mbaya mm-hmm. and uh, okay let's just focus on the, the way of life or mm-hmm. ama the journey because yeah. uh, ingo yake mm-hmm. iko white but inaenda ikikuwa dark mm-hmm. kwa sababu huku kwenye mm-hmm. kuko bright mm-hmm. ni udogo ama ujana wake Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm dogo. You're like somehow you're pure. Yeah. You, you, you don't know things, you know. Mm-hmm. So, uh auna scenes, yeah. auna nini, but ki grow, unajua vitu mobu, you know. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. So, uh na anatembea life yake inaenda ikiisha and mm-hmm. the more na grow comes darkness. Mm-hmm. Kwa sababu death death inatumika nga tu with black, yeah. with darkness, yeah. sindio? Yeah. And she's walking down the aisle that yeah so it's just the way of life unaenda tu unafanya mambo unafanya mambo but in the end of the day time is running mhm no unaenda tu hapo unipatie hiyo umesema the gown it's white yeah why but well it's white hapa hivi kwa sababu hii ni ujana like from hapa hivi kuna kwenye kwa bright but bado inaenda ukiwa ukiwa maybe pre unit hujui vitu okay ukizaliwa hata hujui anything mm. ukifika pre unit somehow you know people you yeah, know yeah, yeah. and then from knowing people 
that's when you start knowing dreams. But companies. even those in a funders, in a funders, in a funder, mm -hmm. you can become a good person, you can become a bad, a bad person, but still, time is running. Mm -hmm. So the ground resembles life. Yes. That's yes. why, ah, yeah. in a make sense, no wonder most people when they die, they always start it with guns. Yeah, the drawing itself in nature to life. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So far, it's on those lately. Yeah. So, do you use just pencils? Am I your pens? No, no. Oh, me, I, I specialize mostly. There were some things I used to use uh, paints, but mm -hmm. lately I'm just using uh, pencils. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, na two pencil more just pendangi ko mix mix. Nikitaka kitu shout sana don tatumia colored pencil ya black. Oh. Yeah. So how much is one? Okay, maybe in A4. Come mm on, -hmm. A4. Yeah, uh, A4. Yeah. Like me, what we need at our kishangi A4. We need kishanga his size A3. Yeah, A3 need that 500 because ni in the same na yeka for frame with glass and everything just how you want it. Mm -hmm. Ata portrait za watu, but I couldn't manage to come with some because what we need are really. But I have a, a, one portrait. You have. Yeah. I have one portrait too. You have? You have it right yeah, now, right yeah, now, right yeah, now? Yeah, yeah. I'm sure I should. I should. Yeah. 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 Okay, there's this one. Hey, so yeah. you're talented. <laughs> In exact. <laughs> Vienna car, Vienna Kanga, Chunduiko. Sante. Come, you can't remember any chore. I'm talking about a rock. You can't do to save your life. I can't. Okay, so mm -hmm. uh, oh, so this is a friend of mine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. He's supposed to come for it next week. So yeah. Can I have? Oh, it looks nice. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna see you for Apple. Ushai Malizia. So where is it? Even though Ako, Ama. Even though Ako. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So what are the some what are the some of challenges you na pitianga every time? Kichora, Ama kwa clients. Nini challenges? Well, challenges mingi. Still challenges when you zinatoka from me. It's challenges when you watu wana kujanazo. Because mm -hmm. mostly, mtu, okay, for example, mtu aneza kwambia, mchore, singe, mm -hmm. of course I'm going to draw you because you see, it's an order like ume, ume tisha. Mm -hmm. But then, uh, watu wengi, nikisha mwambia portrait yako yuko ready, mm -hmm. they're just like, oh, I want that. Nime sota. Nime sota, pencil zangu zimeisha, alafu na nyambuta. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, mm -hmm. you know, well, it, it, that's the only challenge, but yeah. it's something, it's manageable because mm -hmm. at least you can tell people, leave a deposit concern mm -hmm. and then, you know, uh, yeah, to co just confirm the order. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Before you draw. Ah. Yeah, before I draw. Okay. So, okay, before Chware, unakunga na, okay, do you dream? Ama unakunga TV, unapata vision, Chware, juvi kuna vitu zingine, there's a certain drawing. I think I've ever seen it. Uh, it's a river, mountain. Uh, oh, here you can, uh, you can show us. I can. Yeah. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. um, Niku watu liyota ama uliona from samu kachora ama? Hii eh, ilikuwa overthinking <laughs> overthinking and uyu okay hii ni mti but hii mti iko dry na iko kati iko kwa mto like you can see iko kando ya mto and then nyasi imemea yani kila kitu iko fresh lakini yeye amekauka huyu ni mtu ha utilize like ama ni mtu hatumi akili atumia kini juu mm -hmm. uko around hizi vitu zote and still you can't mm -hmm. see kuna milima mm -hmm. milima okay ni watu wenye at least wameweza kutumia brains zao the right way mm -hmm. and still this one they have everything 
and they still can see anything. Na iko mbele ya macho yao but still they still can't do anything. Bado amekauka tu hapo, ako stagnant. Na kwa kando ya mto, atumi maji. Oh, so most of your drawings na kujanga through you overthinking. Yeah, sometimes overthinking and nikaweza hata kitu pia nitaichora. Utaona tu kitu na utamko kumbuka uchore. Eh, eh. Lakini unajua ndoto size zingine hazikwangi you know, like hazikwangi vivid vile. Unakwanga tu. Pengine unaona hata pengine ukumbuki. Ah. Hata ukani kuchora labda uchore. Maybe sura umeona ama mti umeona, cloud umeona. Ikwangi ni kitu unaweza rely on as such. Unless maybe ko ni baraka. <laughs> yes. Okay. Oh, kuna watu wengi wanasema anga zao visions kuna mtu anaweza cut hivi apate visions anze kuchora yeah. so i thought yeah, yeah condition yeah. visions pia mtu anaweza chora cuz i have done some mm-hmm. but hizo aziko sahihi so in short kwa ni maana kwa zote zenye umeza outline you're talking about life and mostly youth so drinks zako ni za tu okay kama you're trying to motivate young people out here yeah uh, to as an isonge by actually i kill you just walk by but you make it so vizuri mama they walk on the right path yeah yeah uh-huh. mostly it's about protecting yourself on the inside more than you do on the outside because the trend you are focused on the wrong thing yeah. so instead just focus on on your spirituality you know cleansing yourself on the inside yeah. instead they are angel ukizidanganya mbona unadanganya watu na jumu tutata kono uko ije kule kai ule mtana ama ule kijana anakaanga poa lakini ana kisuka brains empty eh so like ni chafu pia unaona so yeah it's about just telling people just cleanse yourself on the inside no one has to know mm, sure but there is a bit of a person thing you can enjoy mm-hmm. it's inside mm-hmm. yeah sure ah uh, umesema pia unafanya kazi nyingine tofauti yeah. apart from drawing unafanya graphics and i'm seeing your samples here yeah. t-shirts mm-hmm. t-shirts bags mm-hmm. nafanya branding and printing basically ni zote mm-hmm. na print anything it's just mm-hmm. anything na design anything so uh, yeah kitu ni zote tu from anywhere yeah. in the design yeah. design yeah. na business cards nafanya kila kitu nafanya business cards mm-hmm. just stickers mm-hmm. pia nafanya embroidery ah. uh, screen printing mm-hmm. press just everything mugs flasks mm-hmm. na hizi kwa hiyo mm-hmm. natumia nga hizi sana sana <laughs> don't worry we have we have one we have one here eh uh, kitaka mm-hmm. she'll tell you where you can find her eh yeah. mfanye business amta kwa sana amezi kwa sana <laughs> ni affordable hata yeah. uh, sure nakwambia haezi kukon yeah. uh, <laughs> msana mzuri sana she can't con people mm. so please ukiprintisha the same okay kuna new shape printisha na ni drawing yako wewe mwenyewe yenye umechora wewe mwenyewe ndio kaprintisha kwa t-shirt yes Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Sasa mostly hizo mm-hmm. zinakuanga vitu zenye. Acha labda tu zikwe tu picha cuz I can't come with it here but mm-hmm. I, I I sold it. Ilikuwa mm-hmm. t-shirt ya white na ilikuwa hiyo sketch ya money yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. So but any printing nafanya. Ikuwa mimi unataka picha yako, ikuwa unataka picha ya an artist just anything. It just acha mtu anatuma artwork. If you don't want me to do the design for you we can also send me your artwork and I'm just going to do it and the price will be the same ama well prices differ mostly mm-hmm. in the sizes no matter to know here kama drawing yako okay now we let's say kama hii let's say a drawing umetoa mahali mm-hmm. ukiuza ikuwa hivyo price itakuwa more ama okay as compared to mm-hmm wewe kuprintisha na your own your own own image mm. inyo mefikiria hivyo hivyo price itakuwa the same ama yeah, it's a different price itakuwa to the same because mm. atoki okay, nitumie hiyo artwork mm-hmm. i'll still have to draw it again on the computer mm-hmm. ndo ni toy yeah so it's it's still a process bado 
ndio maana praise hiyo praise ya hiyo haizi bifa okay so you know outside here we have young people who drop na maybe amefika mahali wako na like ah this thing is not helping haiuzi fanye nini ame give up na life na maybe that was the only other option they had naweza waambia nini outside there well it hiyo kitu watu wanambi wangu sana na somehow hata unaonanga tu mtu tu anasema tu lakini bado somehow we na make sense just don't give up yeah. ukiomba utakufa you just have to pray mm-hmm. unajua cause watu wengi wapendangi kuambiwa lakini ni kweli na pia watu wengi wapendi kuambiwa don't give up ama never give up mm-hmm. giving up is very easy mm-hmm. it doesn't cost you your energy your time you just decide miss fine mm. but ukiamua amua tu na roho moja but still we na depend kama you know if you really want something mm-hmm. you just have to go and get it yeah kuna mtu anataji kuwa convince you that you don't give up mm. if it's in you you're going to go and get it yourself because mm. unajua what it takes to be you ama what it takes to be ama to do what you're doing you know mm. so just believe in yourself if you want it wewe mwenyewe ndo unajua ato ni ukaweza ambiwa ati wiki hata kina opera wakuja wa ku advise kama unajua utaki utaki opera hata kufanya utaki eh hata kufos yeah so watch up give up yeah, yeah basically just don't give up cause even ndo kuna kuanga huko nje you just have to try somehow hata kama mambo ni ngumu wewe jaribu una option you just have to try yeah, yeah. especially when you're young Don't just your life. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. The best time to mold your future is from 20 to 25 years. Okay. Honestly, yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. the best time yeah. you're supposed to mold your own future. Mhm. Mhm. So, she kwa she kwa in life in me. We feel to no I mean we give up my life and we choka. Hizi vitu najaribu ku ku market. Sakuna kitu na happen. Hata mostly kama you're selling them online, you know, sana sana lazima kuwe na anizo nini lazima ukwe na lazima u give up yeah. haraka mm-hmm. so she pick up at that point eh yeah. nimewahi i think watu wengi tu like especially ukiwa at the age from 19 or after high school kila mtu anakuanga na yako ka pressure eh eh mm-hmm. mimi nataka ku get do mm-hmm. kwa zata watu wengi hata wakimaliza shule wanakuanga like mimi nikirudi shule nikaendea results nakuja na gari na gari hataka ni ya kuomba unaona like watu wako na pressure ya ku show sana and honestly that was me nilikuwa tu na hizo like pressure mingi na jaribu huku ndodi hata mtu akiniuliza hata umefanya job gani niko like hey nimeuza manguo nimeenda gikomba nimeenda siji nimepika like nimefanya job mob and at the end of the day umechoka like cuz i'm still young you're hustling a lot and nothing is working out for you. Yeah. And singino na sianga tu umechoka especially when you're not relying on anyone you know mm-hmm. it's you and you and you you're not mm-hmm. borrowing anyone money you're not like relying on anyone either emotionally mm-hmm. financially you're not so hata mimi ni moist here hivyo and honestly sio place yenye mimi na hata naweza ombea mtu mwingine akuwe cause it's a dark place mm-hmm. when you feel like you don't have anyone or even anything pengine hata hata pia unasikiani kama unaomba mm-hmm. like you're praying still nothing nothing unashinda <laughs> eh still like like eh like life ilikuwa ngumu hivi lini mm-hmm. and somehow it bado ni wewe tu when you find yourself on the inside nothing else will matter on the outside because me i was so focused on the outside about atinikae poa nona ni bug wa se nona nijisikie tu like hadi mtu akiniona kwa tu zile za eh msichana <laughs> kona do unaona unaona but somehow it's just like me hata sijali mimi sijali kama let me just focus on building my own legacy yeah. that way hata hata ni focus on when i become a mom in the future watoto wangu ndo watakuwa na flex yeah, sio marafiki true. it doesn't have to be people on the outside au tu wenye tu ni wenye and sio hiyo dark dark place it's a really dark place when you feel like you're giving when you actually give up kwa sasa uki give up umeanza jani nyingine mbaya mm-hmm. jani tu yenyewe inishianga ta 
ekange imeshanga mbio uwezi ka 50 years mm-hmm. utakufa mbio exactly. juu ni stress pressure una focus na vitu zenye hata zi make sense mm-hmm. somehow unamwanga tu hata kama wewe unafikiria ati maombi zijibiwi just do it mm-hmm. mungu tana na wanga yes so jay pata depression or anything no 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 sijai kubali Jeffica, at that sijai, point uh, no no i think ni kwa sababu watu wengi sijai taka niko na depression kwa sababu watu wengi wenye wanasema anga niko na depression wanakuanga tu funny cause umefika umejikata unatafuta attention tuta hustle saa ngapi na tutakupea attention saa ngapi mm-hmm. and hata mimi mwenyewe nitatoa time time hizo nitakuwa depressed ama nita focus na kutafuta job mm-hmm. Yeah. So somehow una jamulianga tu. Uji realize tu you're not suited for that like that's it's not you. Yes. Ivo mimi nimeambia watu wengi hivyo like that's not you. Uko usikue hivyo. Yeah, you're not built like that. Okay. So Okay, there's one thing these young people they don't understand. Kama these challenges let's not fanyanga the ones that build us. Kama, okay, there's this say that says challenges are stepping stones to success. Yeah. So kuna oh, oh, atu, I don't get why most youths occupy the challenges, they feel like the world is against them. Because uh, eh, watu wa, wanatakanga tu wakue ever okay. Watu wa jamek peace with the fact that mm-hmm. life I yezi kuwa smooth. Ayezi, ayezi. Mm-hmm. Unajua the moment you, you make peace with that. Mm-hmm. I'm you make peace with I'm okay right now and I'm not hoping for the bad things to come, but I have to be ready. If anything bad happens, I'm ready. Inside. Inside najua hata nini kikuja, me I'm ready. Nitajua kuji control vizuri and I'll know it's not my fault, you know. Cause unajua watu wengi hata they, they end up blaming themselves yeah because of vitu zenye at CG they are going through what ama pia wanaanza ku blame watu wengine mm. and then comes psychopaths do watu wengi wako wako so focused na vitu zenye hata zi make sense okay. na watu au watu wenye wako hivyo ni watu wale selfish because mm. if you're selfless sivani kama dunia ingekuwa venye na kuanga saa hizo mm. at least mambo ingekuanga a bit different Yeah, yeah. Mimi nafikiria anga tu hivyo. So, back to our graphics. Mm-hmm. Ni mwana you're working with public service commission. Well, uh, any so, job tu nilipewa. Yet I'm working with them. I'm mm-hmm. never working with anyone. So mm-hmm. just give me the job, the job and I do it. Ivo tu. So, wao ni kunipigia tu ananipigia. So, so you've said you're 21. Yeah. And you're having two businesses right now. Yeah. As you're speaking, yeah. you're having two businesses. Ya kuchora na pia hii graphics and design. So, eh hiyo ni ujenza gari unatumia. Si ujenza. Tuambie huku huku nje tunataka kujua, tunataka kujua. Hiyo si. Well, sasa okay, hii naichukulianga tu kama one because zote ni art, ni venye tu ni fields different za art. But uh, I think watu watu wanafaa focus na passion sana. Uh-huh. Sasa tuone ati eh ati ule ile business na unanga ile inakoanga na do mm-hmm. unaenda unaharibu mambo mambo inasemkia tu yote unaona but uh, ukijamulia like when you just tell yourself misaki kuomba pesa from anyone especially from parents because mm-hmm. watu wengi gato unaweza kuta mtu wako dhati na bado wako kwao unaona mm-hmm. and wezi somehow you can't blame anyone for anything apart from them yeah. or apart from the parents somehow cause me as a parent nikiona uko dhati na bado uko kwangu labda iko na nilisha cause watu wengi wana take advantage ama watu wame, kama hiyo mti yenye nimekuonyesha uh, especially uko Nairobi Nairobi kuna opportunities kila mahali ukitembea pesa mm-hmm. eh? but watu ni venye watu mi ujanja the right way tumia tu akili utaumu ukienda mahali uuze utaumu ukikuwa mjanja mm-hmm. you just have to look for ways na uwezi ka hapo hivi useme hakuna ma jobs mm-hmm. uko na simu mm-hmm. unanua bundles like you literally buying bundles so ndio ka scroll kuna mm-hmm. venye wasichana wanauliwa Nairobi 
and badala tu uende ukaangalia at least vitu zenye watu wanafanya kuna opportunities nyingi zenye hata you just earn money ukiwa tu hapo mm-hmm. ama you just get ideas of what to do ideas yeah. kwa kila mali kuna watu wanatumia internet the right way yeah. si lazima ununue bundles at uende ama ti uko na wifi especially kwanza hata wenye wako ngati wengi wanakonga na wifi kwa nyumba mm-hmm. hata sio bundles so that that's a person when you attack on internet 24/7 Mm-hmm. Just do something take advantage of what you have utaumwa hata mm-hmm. ikikuuma nikituta manage yeah, nikituta manage uta utaumwa physically hata mm-hmm. kama ita ku drain you're, you're not going to drain 100% yeah, yeah. yeah it's, it's true mm-hmm. it's a bad picture when you are you're, you have an id na bado unategemea mako au babako that nataka nguo surely nguo yeah i know a person who for 40 years and it's a man 40 years a man yeah 40 like 40 40 40 40 yes. for real yes in fact he's 40 40 like 40 40 40 like for real 40 yes yes, yes. ako 40 hata bado anaonganga pesa na ni wale wa oh anakupigia simu si unajonga hao watu wenye anaweza nunua hata airtel ya zao mhm nikupigia watu mtumie that k sijui sijui nani ni mgonjwa and this person hata hafanyia hii kitu siati amejenga kwao hakuna kitu amefanya na hiyo hiyo ando zana ntoa si niyo kuomba <laughs> kwani yako job shot is a beggar wow yeah na ni wale ni ule mtu mwenye mm-hmm. anajua kuteka watu like mdomo yake ni tamu yeah, eh, si unajua watu akivaa asipo unateseka mhm yeah but Well, au au ni watu wenye naweza sema sound or hizo mtu hiyo mtu yenye nimekonyesha like watu wajui ku utilize huyo mtu ni ule mtu hata kienda jiongelelee mahali hata mm-hmm. anaweza pata tu pesa hapo tu but then they can't ni mtu akona talent mingi ni mtu lakini ajitumi venye hapendi kuchoka ni mwana wangu sure man please i'm begging you please eh uh-uh. <laughs> Okay ni leo utapata bibi. Hawezi. Sasa ta uko 40 sasa hivi. Ah, hiyo hata anatoka. Atatoka kwa dunia kwa tu single. Sasa tata lini. Yeah. But I feel okay. Sisi wewe watu wenye tuko young, tunafaa kuchukua okay, tunafaa ku take advantage of everything we have. Um cuz hata watu wengi wanasemanga pia Marib, live alone my boy. Mm. Cuz right now I know hakuna mzazi anaweza kukubali mwanaume yote kwa nyumba akwe kwa 18 ama 19 na baada ya kukwake yeah yeah and najua parents are now this they don't understand that yeah kuna podcast nilikuwa nasikia na ilikuwa about young people and time yeah. so well the main thing about the podcast host mm-hmm. they were saying about how the only thing young people wako rich in it's just time yeah hiyo tu ndo uko rich nayo mm-hmm. hata ukienda tu tiktok watu wazee wakiulizwa what would you tell people when you wako in their 20 some mid you know na like 20s mm-hmm. wanasema to just use your time well yeah, yeah true tumia tu time yeah. yako vizuri haina mm-hmm. jo waste and then ukifika sasa hizo 40 ndo unaanza kuchangamkia job mm-hmm. eh no utateseka kwa maisha na pia historia as young ones wengine hao watu nyako shule let's say college yes university unaanza kuambiwa na watu ati the course you are doing hata haina haina market haina pesa haina nini to me okay that's a lie yeah it's always a lie kwani mwenye anafanya yeye ana pesa eh hapo kwa ofisi yeye ndio alikuja na maji akajeka hapo aje this is when yendo atataka ngi atujiamini atataki you don't want to atataki kuchoka na pia watu wanataka eh nimeanza job hii mwaka mm. by december nataka nikwe millionaire niko na niko na Mercedes niko na Range Rover awezi awezi ni watu watu focus na kitu moja mm-hmm. just live in that moment don't live in the future ama the past just live in that moment and focus on if you're living in the future just focus on making it better than it is right now yeah, right mm. and don't forget um idle mind is a devil workshop Every time unapata unapata time uko free just keep yourself busy doing something constructive something that will market you outside here eh hey, sahi hatuna time ya kuwaste sahi atuchekeshi na dunia yeah, you're yeah. not young mm-hmm. uh, okay so i'm i'm so sure you having these two businesses umejipanga pia financially 
you're not misusing your money hata unaka una account umejipanga ama na kusifu bure acha tusiombe tusifika hapo na kusifu bure ah serve you kao i know umejeka vizuri umejipanga so unaweza mbe ni young people who are out here wenye najua ni wengi sasa hivi wanapata kuna yeye pia unapata kwa na such businesses at this age na the kind of au akipata tu pesa kidogo wanaenda kwa pedi nataka hii nataka tunge bangi moja nataka fanye nini wanaenda club they drink wana maliza pesa wote then kesho tena wakiingia job they have nothing at all so nazambia hiyo sasa me honestly and no offense but i think that the damage is being what you are saying i think it's cool but it's not smart oh nafikiria uko umechanuka na uko hapo hivyo mtu akikuona hivi yani you just see a very dumb person yeah. thinking they know things but they don't yeah, and honestly me okay somehow you you can't really know why someone is using the drugs yeah. but kuna vitu zingine unaweza justify honestly you can never justify going out and spending over 20000 mm-hmm. on one night no unafikiria hizo vitu ni cool na kesho yake bado you're still doing the same thing yeah. and it's not like you're going through anything you know at somehow unaweza elewa mtu mwenye anatumia kama wana go through something but they're not yeah. going through anything mm-hmm. they are not well kama kuna mtu mwingine na anatumia any drug ni vibaya honestly yeah. unakosea na usifikirie umechanuka hujachanuka you just wasting your time you're wasting yourself mm-hmm. thinking you're smart ama thinking you're i don't know when you celeb hata tukujui wewe unaribika uko peke yako peke yako si tutasikia tu sijui nani aliwazimikanga hata <laughs> tutasikia ju probably atukujui so just be smart wewe fanya vitu zenye unajua tu mtoto wako akikuona in the next like 20 years it's going to be a flex for them knowing wow. that's my dad that's my mom like me unaona like somehow unasianga watu wenye wanasema anga eh mimi mwangu tu najua vitu zingine aeze hata wewe hata uki no do a funny thing watu wenye wana wana influencing hata wenzao kufanya hizo vitu wengi wao wazazi wao wako church true i have a friend mwingine hapo alianguka kwa club i know her mom like i know her mom ni wale tumelelewa area moja um msichana ameanguka sijui ni nini alienda kupewa uko kwenye so it's you know like kwa club sijui vip nini 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 you know the things they do around there and then this kagal ameenda alafu amerudi ameanza kubishana na watu kwa club but someone sayo unabishania boyfriend the boyfriend aja kuoa aja aja hakuna hata mama kwa mjui na una unampigania boyfriend hata akupigania in the first place na umeanguka boyfriend yako pia amelewa yani have you ever seen like messed people messed up people look like guy what are you doing mimi sasa nilimwona nikakumbuka mama yake cuz mama yake hata ni wale wakipokea si unajua anga watu wakipokea sacrament kwa church wanapiga magoti she's catholic but anajifunga like those orthodox christians wenye anaka muislamu amejiweka vizuri but she's christian 100% Nicole like apana kwanza ata msichana na tapi nguvu hey girls out here una tapi nguvu ya kupigania boyfriend boyfriend ya yeah, yeah, like mimi hata hata mwanangu siwezi mpigania na sio uh, uh, it's just a no is only bitu zenye ziko kwa movies mm-hmm. so you just love yourself yeah. when they na like especially ukijua mama kwa amekulia vizuri mm-hmm. ringa ile design yenye hata mama kwa akisema ule ni mchana wangu pia ana ringa mm-hmm. like your mom is going to be like imagine that's my baby girl yeah. utakuwa hata wenzake wa mama watakuwa liko ni mchana wako mm-hmm. wangu nje mwambie kuja muongeleshe wangu yeah yeah yeah, yeah. be that friend mwenye nikisema eh mam niko na michelle she, she's like oh uko na michelle ni sawa at least uko na uko na michelle 
Ule wana buta bangi. Just having principles. No kiji understand wewe. No jua venye. Fanya kitu kijua. Eh, mangu akiona hii. Acha fry. Na pia we build ourselves, you know. Tukifika yo nini temi ya poor parents. At least your kid. Atasema my mom, she's my role model. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tati, atakuwa na story to tell about you when you're not there. Tati, kifika ni anambuwa apiani story yako, na shuna vini atasema. Yeah, yeah. Adi, kuna watu anaibika anga ata wangilengi. Najwana na watu wengi na niko tu na example. Le have a friend of mine mwenye amishi kukidanganya. Like, ama hama. Anishi Maju. Whole time her mom is living in Siji where Kibera and a friend of mine once went to see her because here peke yake ndo anajua mama yao kina uyu msichana. No mama ni she's an addict like wa is on staff and it's sad honestly it's sad because the girl is bowling bowling lakini hata jai enda kwa nao mamake ever since she started Na pese nyo na toa happy birthday ya kubwalba. You already know. It's Nairobi. Nyo it's Nairobi. You already know. Okay. So, apart from all these, okay, any talents, hobby, what's your hobby? Niko na hobby kumoa. Tuambia zote, nwanda ni mkuli hizi. Ya kando kwenye. Okay. Well, mi napenda kukulia sana, because I work a lot, and I spend so much time working yes yes it's a hobby but when you when you overdo something or when you overwork sometimes you just want to chill you know but honestly me i i read a lot of novels i read books 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 because at the end of the day somehow we need the knowledge the knowledge are you call online are you call instagram you call books and ato uki ukienda tu nunue kitabu mia mtumba na hizo kwanza hata ndo mzuri honestly and well napenda kusoma kitabu aki napenda vitu mingi i listen to music every time when i'm working i'm just listening to music when i'm just doing anything i'm listening to music before i sleep i listen to music every time yes i think those are my favorite and I like traveling, though I don't travel. So how come traveling is one of your hobby now you don't travel? I just, I get some time and travel. But then when I don't like, sometimes you know, like, hey, we can't just need to leave. So that's when you decide, not to spend, but just to go somewhere and chill, you know? Yeah. Okay. So, 22 out of topic, kabisa, kabisa, kabisa. What's the ideal kind of money for you? Your ideal kind of money. What? Kind of money. Kind of money? Yeah. Wow. Uku inze na jawa kuna wano miwingi, wano liza. Ako single, ama... Oh, yes, Kiwi. Okay. What's the ideal kind of money? I don't... Kwa tuna adabu. Adabu wa makili. Okay, on a double for Nakili. You can't have a double be like you. Yeah, yeah. You do. Attake, 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 kushinda. I I'm grateful, so. But you come for fun. I'm not the man. Eh, okay. What is I? Uh, Atipo decides. Miss Pendy was to a meunga, of course. Yes, but I don't really focus on physical looks. They matter though. Yeah, they matter. They matter. Like any, si juu si juu kiriya, si juu. Yes, or sero na kiriya. But sengi ne, akiwa. That's so random. But it's but it's true. Most ladies who come here asking me, I want a tall, dark, handsome man. Dark and handsome. You may be handsome here, eh? I may be handsome here, but I'm not a cap boy. But I'm a killy. You know, some women are twenty four seven, twenty four seven, twenty four seven. Because you know, perhaps maybe you're more brighter than him, or maybe you're not curious enough to change. Yeah, but if 
enye i deal i, I deal ni hata nikipeleka kwa mamangu ya yeah, ama babangu kwa week yes babangu ata collect ndio <laughs> 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 Okay, I'm also a lady, yeah. but pia I kuna venye kuna venye utapatia boy child rights zao kidogo. Kuna venye. Why? Sasa, I don't I uh, I'm a girl's girl mostly like mimi napendanga kutetea wasichana sana. Sasa mimi sijui nini nini but I just find myself loving girls not in that way. Panaelewa <laughs> that way but mimi napendanga kutetea wasichana kwa sababu wasichana wengi wana, wanaonekana anga wanyonge unaona yeah. and kuna kwanga na hiyo biasness hata kama bado tuko 2024 mm-hmm. bado kuna hiyo biasness ni venye tu watu wana wanajaribu kuipaint na money yeah. watu wanajaribu kuipaint na baby girl treatment mm-hmm. but all time you just I don't know unadi unadi mean wasichana. Mm-hmm. I'm not saying here vijana hatuadi mean at some point we do a lot and I know at which point. Kutoka tena za conversation ni wapi umetitia boyjana. No I'm saying like mm-hmm. like najua tu huwa tuna tunawashusha chini kidogo mm-hmm. especially me but not in that way. Mm-hmm. It's just that mm-hmm. you already know you're strong. Yeah. Men are strong. Yeah. Lakini girls wasichana ni watu wanakwanga very delicate honestly me hata hata uko umelelewa wapi mm. at some point something is just makes you weak yeah and somehow that me sina hate na boys or, or sina hate na na male gender mm-hmm. lakini una <laughs> <laughs> rumia tu wasichana eh, eh na urumianga na me included mm. cuz me hata unaweza kuwa around places like unaona especially unaona kama out of the topic like makanga yeah like there's a day a friend of mine got slapped by a makanga mm-hmm. and aliflapiwa hata aka flip kama kwa movie yes and it was bad and this makanga was trying to come at me mm-hmm. but honestly mimi mi, nilimwambia like uwezi bishana na msichana and not because at you already know you have more power than i do especially physically uko na nguvu utanipiga and i told this guy wewe utanipiga to kutaka wewe utanipiga vibaya sana and i can't really do anything about it just respect yourself as a man and the only reason why me honestly watu wengi wananibu wengi especially men ni kujaribu i already know you're strong and i already know I na just do at you want to that is you is you is I don't want to hear that yeah. it doesn't matter I know and I'm a female na me know my place yeah. I know my place mm-hmm. so you know kitenya ni boingi na most men mm-hmm. trying to show us they they are I don't know they call the shots yeah. Yeah. and I know you do call the shots mm-hmm. but you don't have to tell me I already know, yeah, you know. Yeah. so no kitaka yenyewe u get your respect mm-hmm. from any female just know your place mm-hmm. unajua ukijua place yako utajua i don't have to tell her because mm-hmm. she also knows her place yeah. and me i respect myself as a man mm-hmm. i don't have to be shana bishana na mna msichana hapa hivi ndo aniogope you don't have to do that hata sasa hata ndo maana hata mnapiga mnapigana yes. sijui yeah. unaona hizo vurugu vurugu mingi mingi cause au jitambue ukijitambua kama a real man not even a boy ukijitambua like as a real man at least you're going to be like Mr. Bishana na huyu msichana i just tell her mimi sitaki hivi sitaki hivi na mimi i'm not going to argue or fight with you or slap you cause I know you're not going to fight back but pia I know sometimes my demo anakoseanga ku provoke mtu yeah sure. like eh hey, nipige nipige kana tafanya kani mwanao nipige 
Hapana. <laughs> like kila mtu ni ajue place yake but wasichana wengi ni wale okay mimi nachanga wasichana wengi kwa sababu wasichana wengi wamedimiliwa at some point that uh, as for me it's if you're not young one child yeah that's young okay both genders jo jo pia okay but for boys na ni watete it's a relationship relationship yeah. wise ju uh-huh. kuna hii mentality madem tuko nayo at if if you have a man yeah. you're not supposed to use your money yeah yeah Uh-huh. But, uh-huh. <laughs> you're not supposed to use your money. There's one thing, okay. Relationship ni nini? Unafaa kufanya nini kwa relationship at first? Nikusaidiana. Yeah. When I'm down and you're okay, you're helping me. And when you are down and I'm okay, I'm supposed to help you. We're supposed to help each other, not using another person. But any kitu moja ase madimu kunje. We don't understand that. Unafanya boy child anaenda kwa mjengo, amefanya kazi yetu anataka kupata pesa yote. Anataka pesa ya sana, anataka pesa ya nini, anataka pesa ya nini. That's not good. Yeah, that's not good at all. Una kuanga na limits. I'm not saying you're not supposed to give me money. You're actually supposed to give yeah, me money. To. But mm-hmm. I'm not relying on you for everything. Yeah. Na hapo hivyo ndo honestly hapo hivyo ndo wasichana wengi wanakosea. Yeah. Wana uko focused, uko job lakini bado unataka yote. How? Ni kama mwingine ana responsibility. Eh eh eh. Ni kama ni milionea. Mhm. That's one thing nonanga madim tunakosianga sana 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 sana. Yeah. And talking of that kuna history um that is trending yeah girls being killed. Yeah. Eh yeah, your story your yeah, feminism. Hey, your story. Uh, your story. Na mm-hmm. itabidi hey, tumeenda hey. break. Hey, yeah, yeah. Okay, so guys, we're going for a break. We're taking a break. Then we'll come back to talk about for me feminism and stay there we'll stock up with. Judy Kituto, Director of VT welcomes you to Vision Empowerment Training Institute. We have three campuses, Nairobi, Kitengela, and Mombasa. Courses we offer include ICT, Business Secretarial, Hairdressing and Beauty, Journalism and Mass Communication. Hospitality and Tourism, Health, Community Development, Criminology, Electrical, Mechanical, Plumbing, Fashion and Design, Plant Operator, Co-curricular Activities, and Cultural Events. Visit www.vt.ac.ke. Come learn from the best. Doctors through the below numbers. Oh, welcome back. And before the end of the story of uh, your feminism, uh, earlier, I was going to say that boy child, I was going to say that. Remember, I was your man, and see, I was going to say that. 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 Apendi, apendi kuomba, apendi kufanya nini, apendi kufanya nini. No your responsibility as a man. You're supposed to know your responsibilities. Usi kila siku ile time demo anakuambia nataka hii, nataka hii, nataka hii. Unafanya anakaa bega, naifa hivyo, naifa hivyo. Yeah. And I hope umeona hizo videos za wenyewe madem wanaulio ufuni nje wanafanya nini. Like those videos. They look bad. Yeah. Mataizi. Maybe by sana. Funny thing is of it was me issue kuwa yeah even you want to notice cause it's airbnb involved now mnasikianga mm-hmm. airbnb mnasikianga tu ni ashawo business yeah true mm. well no, somehow pia wengine wanafanya hiyo business a lot lakini ujui wengine wamuuliwa kama maybe maybe ni boyfriend you just don't know yeah and tunajua kuna kwamba na watu wenye wana taking it to personal into an argument and then asira no una no wana yeah, yeah, yeah. but mimi sioni hiyo ni vibaya honestly ni vibaya yeah actually on my side i think because okay you as a lady or as a man when you meeting this person because obviously before you start dating unajua nanga ukishajua mtu ni mtu asira mtu anini na if you can't handle that 
please walk away. Walk, walk away. Yes. Run. Muri yes. per run. Muri yes. <laughs> per run. Just run. So go round up. Hmm. Hmm. And if you buy a lucky, because it's all lucky. Name me now, na. When you, when you, when you, when I just want to meet any boyfriends, mm. but they are not. They are not boyfriends. They are not boyfriends. You need to end up with a family member when you, and then people just go their own ways. Kwanza yo. I'm Juan. I'm Juan. And mm. na, the only reason unajua watu wengi wana blame wasichana sana. Yeah. But the only reason why I feel like wasichana ndo wana kwa blame iwe mm-hmm. it's cause our judge our ja nini standard zao like what just set standard zao ile ya. Mm-hmm. Mimi there's no way I just met this person. I might met them online. Tume meet leo. Mm-hmm. And uh okay, tume meet leo. Okay, tumeanza kuongea leo, si ndio? Tume meet leo and then you're expecting me to just come mm-hmm. and do things with you. Like I'm a human being mm-hmm. and I have standards. Oh. Lakini sasa unajua wasichana wengi wasee ni I am standards, mm-hmm. you nini nini. Mm-hmm. Just going to go and do it because unajua eh hey, umsi hapo na bug. Na nikitoka, nikienda home, mama at least dio tanilipia Uber. Nikifika home, ukifikiria chakuliza kama ulifika they would. Mm-hmm. You get the respect because you earn it, not yeah. because you ask for it. Yeah, no. Mm-hmm. Kwanza si ile mwana. Mm-hmm. Unapatana je na mtu? Okay, mwanza kusema yeye ni Instagram. Mhm. That guy ameku DM that day. Mwanza kuongea na yeye na trust. Unapatana mpaka uko na audacity ya ku meet that person in a Airbnb. So, unatoa pia nguvu. Acha unapata red flag ya kwanza ni the fact that hiyo ni Airbnb. Huyo ni mwanaume mzima. Mbona usinipeleke kwako? Thank you. Why? Hao si vijana wako campus wana wana. Hao mm. ni watu wenye hata uwezi sema huyu ni kijana. Like this is a grown man, yeah. a grown man. Huyu ni mtu mwenye kama unanionyesha hivyo, you have the money. Yeah. My, you have your own house. Mhm. Mbona unipeleke kwako? Mbona unaniambia twende kwa Airbnb? Mm-hmm. And wasichana wataki kutumia kili pia. Mm-hmm. Cuz unadanganywa tu hii bilai. Mm-hmm. And the men are just taking advantage of it honestly. Mm-hmm. I think it's high time ladies tunafaa tunafaa kujijua sahi. Kama I'm so sure watu wa kitambo they had standards. A lot. I'm 100% sure they had standards. Yeah ju sai unapata unapata dem una na tutataka tufanye hivi even if itakuwa okay mtu anaweza kumolest ju ya pesa peke yake pesa wewe una pesa hata you, you don't care about your health unataka kujua kama hiyo pesa ndio itafanya hiyo pesa ndio ita itakuwa ita, ita, ita noise or die fanye nini rudi zero tena yeah. you don't care mm. as in uh, it's high time as ladies get to chini tukirie and we know ourselves cuz uh, whatever is happening is not good at all so yeah course. it's not good na it only starts na sisi bado mimi mm-hmm. nikiamua at least unajua mimi nikiamua mimi mm-hmm. kuna mwanaume atakuja niambie hizo maneno zenye anaambiaambia watu wengine mm-hmm. i'm not mimi hey, na ndo maana watu wanaona sasa hizi wasichana hata ukikati wao unasema unataka twende bnb ndo ni wao mm-hmm. cuz mimi nikishasema at least jina langu haitakuwa kwa news Okay sasa majina yako haitakuwa kwa list. Mhm. Au wenye kama kuko nje na unatafuta college, worry no more cuz there's a college a very nice college. They have they have good lecturers, they have nice classes. They have many courses. Hata kuchora mtafunza kuchora by the way. <laughs> they have eh hey, wanachora wanafunza kila kitu at a very 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 affordable price. Fee price sorry. So Yoshilen is a vision empowerment training institute which has also sponsored this lovely show. Iko na three branches, Nairobi, Kitengela and Mombasa. For more details that could join that school, itapata details there below. Yeah. So see you on the second episode which will be next week. The same same time, same same venue. I love you all.